Hey y'all, what's up? I'm a little zooty, but it's okay. I'm chilling. It's gonna be a list of vibe for my Scorpios. Hold on, let me put my glasses on because this is not cute. Okay. Hey y'all, so let's get into it. It's gonna be for my Scorpios because it's late night, Scorpio. What's the vibe for y'all? Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Also, my donations are open if you guys are, uh, feel guided to donate. Um, you'd be more than welcome to. We got the King of Cups, the Knight of Pentacles, the Chariot, and the Devil. Okay, Scorpio, I feel like y'all are wanting to make a, uh, a gesture to someone. Or, I really feel like you guys are moving ahead. I feel like y'all are moving ahead very uh, balanced-like. I say that because the chariot and then the knight of cups fell out on this side right here. And then the knight of pentacles and then the knight of pentacles is on this side, the knight of cups is on this side. And you look at the cards, there's a black sphinx right here, and then there's the black horse, you know what I'm saying? Vice versa. So I feel like y'all are really balanced right here. And y'all are looking forward to taking action towards something. But it's taking a little bit of time. It's going it's it's taking a little longer than what y'all probably or might have expected here. But it looks like y'all are coming in a contact with maybe a Capricorn. I'm getting maybe a Capricorn here. And uh let's see. Maybe a Capricorn. Let's see. Scorpio, yeah, I'm getting y'all I'm getting real chill vibes from y'all though, Scorpio. I'm not gonna lie. I'm getting real chill vibes with y'all. Um, let's see. Yeah, we got the, yeah, we got the, uh, we got the Seven of Pentacles here. And then we have the Ace of Pentacles on the bottom of the deck. I feel like y'all are really working hard towards something, Scorpio. I feel like y'all are, uh, y'all are hard at work at something here with the, um, with the Ace of Pentacles and the Nine of, and the uh, Seven of Pentacles right here. Seven of Pentacles is all about working at something, like working really hard, you know? And then the Ace of Pentacles is, you know, just complete financial stability, right? So, I don't know if some of you guys could be in the, either in the inter entertainment industry or in the service or anything that's like government official or has to do with like the government and or taxes. I feel like a lot of y'all might be in that industry here. But with the temperance card, I'm really getting that you're really balancing things out right here. You're really fulfilling your own cup as you're taking your time to go ahead and make this action towards this Ace of Pentacles, right? I feel like at this moment, y'all are just really just chilling, fulfilling your own cup, right? I feel like y'all have a plan, right? With whatever you're doing, I feel like y'all have a plan in, in place, right? And you're, you're feeling confident about taking this Dang, all oh, the cards just fell. <laughs> y'all, what the heck? Okay, so yeah, y'all are really tempering, tempering yourselves. Y'all angels are with y'all all the time, by the way. That's also a reminder for saying that your angels are always with you. Um, so we have the, uh, the Eight of Cups, the Three of Wands, the King of Wands, in the judgment card. So, so with the eight of cups here, I'm really seeing that y'all are walking away, walking away from maybe things that um, really didn't serve you or highest or serve your highest good, or you're walking away from you know just people people bullshitting you. You know what I'm saying? That's really what I'm getting. That's the vibe I'm getting. I feel like y'all are walking away from people that's bullshitting you. You know. <laughs> I feel like that's exactly what y'all are doing. Y'all turning y'all back towards towards it. Y'all turning y'all back towards those people, places, and or things. Those empty offers. Those lackluster offers, right? And you're going to look. You're moving forward into looking towards this King of Wands energy. Now, whether this may be you guys moving into this King of Wands energy, or you're looking forward, or you're looking forward to this King of Wands energy right here. Um, this judgment here, I feel like this, whatever you're doing is divinely guided or it's divinely orchestrated. Now, Scorpio, this is your energy here with the devil as well. So I really see that you're really strong in your power. You're really in this, you're more, you're more on like an intense side right now. And I feel Scorpio, not so much with your emotions. I feel like you're walking away from your emotions or you have walked away, not really walked away from your emotions. But you, uh, you're, you're stepping more into this passionate, creative, sensual energy. Like I feel like y'all really focus more on 
you know, your appearance now more than, not even appearance, but acting from a pl better pl a place of like, you know, I'm big daddy or I'm big mama. You know what I'm saying? Period. <laughs> so with the Empress and the Three of Swords, I feel like uh, you had your heart broken or maybe there was a Empress energy or this Empress energy that uh, is, was in a third party situation. I'm gonna say it was, uh, was in a third party situation and it, you know, it was not right or whatever I'm saying here. But I'm seeing this King of Wands here and it's, I don't know, hold on, spirit. what is this? What's this Empress Three of Swords here? You, okay, the Eight of, the Eight of Wands. Okay, and the Five of Swords. So I feel like you've had to fight off. I feel like, I don't know. But whoever I'm reading this for, I feel like you were in a situation or something with an Empress energy, a marriage, a, a commitment with an Empress energy. It didn't work out with this Empress energy. There was a lot of conflict. There was a lot of backstab. There was a lot of bad behavior or, you know, just sick behavior. It's not really good behavior. And it was a Three of Swords situation. It was a third party situation could have been involved and or, you know, just, it just wasn't a good situation. And I see you guys moving away from this slowly but steadily here with the Nine of Pentacles, the Nine of Cups. But you do see yourself moving forward uh, towards, you know, getting back in your power here with the devil energy uh, as being Scorpio as well. Um, you know, just working hard here with the uh, Seven of Pentacles. Looking forward to getting that Ace of Pentacles, you know, getting your money back to where you wanted it to be. And or this is a uh, judgment coming. Uh, maybe it's like an inheritance or something that y'all have been waiting for. But regardless, I see you guys tippering out yourselves right now, walking away from things and minuscule things and things that just don't, you feel doesn't, don't serve you. With the three of wands right here, like, again, the three of wands to the, uh, to the seven of cups. So you're really walking away and turning your back to a lot of things. Uh, probably looking into the direction of this king of wands energy here. And then uh, with the judgment card, I do this, see that this entire process has been divinely guided. Um, Let's see. Dang, seven minutes. All right, Scorpio. I'm getting off of here. I'm, all right, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.